now we will do question number 8b here is the question given for the double column cash book the date transactions and the amount june 1 cash in hand rupees 800 so we know that the cash book cash opening for the favorable cash is al always favorable so it starts from the debit side to side so june 2016 by uh, to balance BD 800 in the cash column then we have bank overdraft overdraft means now you have liability of 5700 you have withdrawn excess money from your bank account so the liability starts from the buy side from the credit side in the previous question both the balance BD started from the two side because there was a there was favorable balance in the bank but now since there is overdraft there's liability so it will start from the buy side 2016 June 1 buy balance PD 5700 okay so once again writing to and buy is not necessary the important is you have to write down the accounts on the correct side so I've not written to or buy on this also but if you write down there is no problem okay it's not that writing down is wrong you can write down but the accounts should be on the correct side received a check from Bharti 3250 now you can see here on 7th we have received the check but deposited the check on 9th so here on 7th the check did not go to the bank it was not entered um, like it was not deposited into the bank so for seven where it is not deposited into the bank but it is remaining in the office we will have the journal proper the journal entry for the check which is there received in the office or it is just received and you have still not deposited in the bank so June 7 checks in hand what you are getting and give it is Bharti checks in hand account debit to Bharti 3250 and 3250 so you are receiving checks in hand okay now the same check was deposited on 9th so here you will not write Bharti you write checks in hand what on 9th you're depositing the check that was given to you through by Bharti so for that on 7th what you received checks in hand you are receiving to Bharti so now this check you are giving it into the bank so since this check you're giving into the bank you will not write the name Bharti you will write two checks in hand and in bank column 3250 what you are giving as a giver giving in the bank okay then you have 12 okay paid to bhavna by check so here on the same day you are paying to bhavna so in this case bhavna is a receiver so you will write on june 12 bhavna by bhavna bhavna account debit and you write in the bank bank column 2425 so here there is no journal proper because bhavna you are paying check to bhavna so bhavna is a receiver and in bank column 2425 then we have bharti's check dishonored now this check which you deposited on 9th of june is dishonored by the bank on 15th that means the bank is returning back so this will straight go back to bharti because this check was in the in name of bharti so here for this check that is dishonored bharti to bank so Bharti will be the receiver of the check because the bank has dishonored, has uh, has returned back the check. 
so bharti to bank so here for this you are receiving a check so for that you have a journal checks in hand to bharti now this checks in hand you are depositing on 9th so two checks in hand now this check was dishonored on 15th so we'll go to bharti bharti will be receiver by bharti 3250 next we have is withdrew from bank for office use now again there will be contra entry withdrew from bank means cash comes in and who is the giver bank account so cash will become as buy and amount will go in the bank column and this will go on the two side June 20 and the amount will go in the cash column and we'll write C and C that is contra entry okay next we have is received from Panna Lal and endorsed it in favor of Kamal on 28th June now this check also is not going through the cash book because you received on 25th check you kept it and then you endorsed means you gave it to Kamal okay so here you'll have journal proper for 25 checks in hand to Panna Lal checks in hand you're receiving checks in check you're receiving and who's the giver Panna Lal and then the same check what you're doing you're endorsing means giving so June 28 you're giving to Kamal so Kamal and what are you giving the check that you had that you had received okay so June 25 you received the check and Pannalal is the giver 28 endorse the check to Kamal and checks in hand has been what is there you're giving the checks in hand okay so it is going to Kamal income tax paid by check so income tax is expense so by now we are writing drawings here why are we writing drawings here because income tax is personal so any personal we write as drawings and in the bank column 150 next we have bank charges now bank charges is some charges relating to uh, the in the passbook it's been deducted for when you use check withdraw money for excess time so the bank charges some amount so the bank charges is also expense so June 30 bank charges and in bank column 25 okay now what we will have to do we'll have to balance but for balancing first we will have to see which side is greater now you can see in the cash column on the debit side we have 850 this side we have nothing okay so this side total is coming to 1050 so since this side we have nothing over here so what we will have to do we will have to balance and so we'll have to write the same amount this side so that this and this will match okay so here simply we have to balance on both the side okay so here what we can see is cash on the debit side is coming 1050 and credit side we have nothing so to balance both the side both the side what we have to do okay so so to balance both the side we have to write the same amount so this side also will have to write 1050 so that 1050 and 1050 June 30 balance CD okay now
next what we have to do is we have to balance the bank okay now if we see this side okay the totaling is coming to 11,800 okay and if we see on this side the totaling okay don't write CD now okay okay let me erase this so you'll understand okay so there was okay so here we have completed our account so this side how much is the balance this side the balance is 3250 so when you compare what you can see this side is greater okay and this side is less how much only 3250 so in order to make equal both the side we'll have to write some amount this side so what we'll do June 30 now the opening now if the balance is coming on this side so closing will come this side now the balance is coming on this side so the closing will be on this side so buy balance CD carry it down and then what we'll do we will minus 11800 minus 3250 okay so what are you going to get is okay so 800 minus 3250 the amount we're going to get is is 8550 okay so here cash book is like a journal and a ledger it is a journal because this is the first place where the transactions can be entered and you have to make the journal in your mind and then you have to put in the cash book and finally you have to balance whichever side is greater you write down and then balance it with the side which is less so now this cd will become the opening balance on july 1 on this side to balance bd 1050 and this cd will become the opening balance on buy side and will write july 1 next month opening buy balance bd 8550 okay so you go through the cash book and uh, keep practicing thank you